Hey everybody, this is Collector Dude. I'm at uh, High Press Books. I'm going to go through these real quick. Got a few minutes on there. It won't be a real long video today, but just to show you a little bit what I'm looking at today. So, haven't done one of these in a while. I like the Flashpoint stuff. This was a good story, the way Wonder Woman handled him. It's like, are you serious? Wow. So, different books I see. That one's a different one. Aquaman. I've been trying to finish some collections of stuff that I have. See, this is a cool story to look looking covered as well. I have all of the Americans got powers, or America has powers, or got powers. But um I'm gonna see some of these other ones. These are cool. I've been trying to find uh, the Rain, Devil's Rain storyline that runs through Image and Marvel Comics. I'm trying to get all the books for that. And these are really cool covers here. I got one of these as a uh, AOK. -okay. That was really cool. Well, that's cool. Number one, 29.9. Okay, I think I'll grab that because it's a special cover. I always like the shiny stuff. Adam Strange, number one, two, three. I'll grab those. I like Pascal Fairy's artwork. There's Animal Man. Okay, wait a minute. Animal Man, one, two, three. Four. These are kind of cool too. Avengers versus the X Men. I like that cover. That's cool. Ramos. I, so I like the certain styles that are real distinctive and stuff like that. That's a real powerful looking style. So I, I wondered about these Archies. Are these like for teenage girls or something like that? Or this like, or teen? Who knows? I'm not sure. Or the adults like these as well. They seem like a lot of like, um, they're making them like the high school love stories and stuff like that. Or for, for teens, which is cool. But I keep falling. Let's see. Let's see, Archie, Archie. Archie. Kind of like that Farrah Fawcett pose from the 70s. The poster, you know, check it out if you don't know. But that's cool. I've been watching some of the videos on YouTube where people are racing, <laughs> which is basically some of it's like illegal racing and everything. And they find out the cops are coming or something like they take off. But it's really cool when you see some of the, these races, you're like, how in the world? And I saw one where a guy, the guys were racing motorcycles and they were up to 200 and something miles an hour. I'm like, you gotta be kidding me. And I'm like, Telling them, slow down, slow down, don't mess up. But if anything would have come out in front of them, somebody even posted that and say, hopefully no one runs out in front of you. Because it's on like a real off the way street. These are cool. Tangent Comics. I remember these when they came out. I don't think I picked any of these up. Dan Jurgens and Paul Ryan. Okay, Rebirth of the Atom. That's a cool cover. I think I got one of those. Aquaman, I never liked this one. I remember when I first saw the artwork and the drawing, I'm like, really? Ugh. That's cool. Avengers Academy. The Cinder, Cinder. I have these Cinder, but these are the new ones. This is okay. 6, 3, 15, 16. Looks like all of them are here except for number one. Okay, then we got the Authority. Assassin's Creed. These were, I was almost going to get these, but they're like adult books or something. But I think some of these are signed. Yeah, so they're down, there, signed at the bottom down there. They were, I think they're not that expensive, but they're all signed. So then I got Atheist here, that's signed. Five dollars. Phil Hester. This one here, number two. Number three signed by him. Okay, Adventure Comics. Aquaman. That's a cool cover. Wow, that's sad. Okay. Authority. Cute little tiger cup. Let's see. That's crazy. Okay, what's this one? Also, that's pretty loud. 
Well, I like that. The, the little dinosaur. I get these. They don't fall. That's cool. All new, all different, seven different. That's cool. Okay, must have. Aquaman. Okay, that's a different one. I like the ones with um, the Adato artwork on them, like these. I have all, pretty much a whole set of those. Let's see. That's a cool costume. Let's see what else. Certain ones I want to collect, but um, not all. Civil War. And I can't remember exactly which ones are going for a little bit of money, but I've been looking at the covers lately. Getting cover grabs. Avengers. I think I, I, think I got that one. That's Diodato. Artwork on the inside. Inf Prelude to Infinity. for the cover. Where's okay. One of these Avengers will die. Oh, oh that's Diodato. His cover. Cool. Let's see. That's a cool one too. I got all of these. Unless I wanted to get a whole set of them or something, I can give them away as a prize. That's a cool cover. I like that. I've always liked that one. Wow. Let's see, I have, I have all of these. Just beautiful covers. That's cool. What number is that? Number... 16. Yeah, number 16 is a cool cover. That's cool too. And yeah. yeah, see if I can find a Iron Man holding the Infinity Gun. That'd be cool to have. I think I got about two or three of those. I shouldn't cover. That's cool too. Annual. Oh, that's cool. Let's see, I like the Dave Finch artwork. Wow. Powerful looking. Let's see. Um, is that Devil Dinosaur or somebody else? I don't know any other red dinosaurs unless they did it and I didn't read about it. That's cool. Let's see. Avengers Academy. I really like that costume. Avengers Solo. So you can see more of them. Okay. I'll have to ra erase something to add more time to my phone. I think I didn't erase the latest videos I uploaded. So if I do that, I'll have more time and I can do another video. That's cool. I like that one. My get on. Let's see. I was a teenage Astro Girl. That's different.
That's nice too. They got some really nice covers on the Avengers. X-Men had thrown in there. I'm trying to bend them over here. That's cool. I'm going to grab that. That's cool. Free Buffy. Back row. That's cool. Year one. What, you, what number is that? Number five. Ben Grimm. I have these at home. I have two and three. And I found number one at one of these other. I'm not sure if it was here or another one. That's a cool cover. Electra. Horn. Cool. Horn. These are cool. I got a set of these as well. Let somebody else have these. I always like to get the Wonder Woman cover though. It's just beautiful. Like Michael Turner, number issue number four of that. That's another. Um, I'll set that aside. I like the shiny cover. I'm not sure about the artwork. Oh, Blackhawks number four. That's the one in three. There's four. One. Three. Was this an eight good? Four. Five. There's four. And a five. I'm gonna have number two in there. I'll set them aside though. Four and five. I'll set them aside. There's four and five. And there's two. Logan or Ben Graham. So let's go through here a little faster. So you got some bombshell covers in here. I'll grab number two. I think these are going for a little bit of money. Something like that's kind of cool. The story and everything. That's a funny cover. Let me set that aside. That's cool. Is that rogue? Yeah. Let's see what else we got in here. That's a cool cover. Five bucks on that one. Birds of Prey. Cool cover. Bionicle. Anybody collect the toys of that? I don't know anything about the toys. That's wild. Okay, we got Vixens. Another crazy cover there. Wow. Beast. Alex Ross. Batgirl. Brotherhood. Blue Flame. These are um, great um, Finch covers there. Booster Gold. And they're supposed to be coming out with a movie with him, I heard. I have a couple of copies of Booster Gold number one. And if I can find them, I'll make sure I'll, I'll use it for, like, upcoming stuff like that. I'll use it for a prize. I don't know if I should get that Blood Wolf, like Angel Medina artwork. These are wild, too, all these covers. Ugh. And we got Blood or Black Wolf, I mean. This monster unleashed. He was a really cool guy. I met him at a, at a uh, convention. Very, very cool guy. Not standoffish or anything like you were privileged to be in his presence if you've ever meet, met any artist like that. But he, he was very cool. The Brotherhood. These are cool covers. Big Man Plans. There's more Batgirl. That's cool. Brotherhood more. Okay, Black Science. I started reading this. I got a big issue 10. It's a very good story. See, I like Rick Remenda because of that. And Matteo Sclera. Sclera artwork. Very cool. Like the stuff he's doing. I think he's the one that's doing the the, the um, other books with um, Batman and um, Harley Quinn. Black. With, I forgot the titles of it, but he's doing those. Doing some new books. But um, I like his artwork. Okay. Cool. Buffy covers. Blade. That's cool. That's different. Let's see if I can see if it's something different. I'm gonna put this put it aside and check it out. The big con job. That's a wild cover. I always thought that. Bug. Big moose. Breach. 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 Hey, Bart Simpson. I'll grab that one. Batman and Superman, I got one of those covers. That's cool. Deceased variant cover. Let me set that aside. That's cool. Uh, I love Jim. This is another one of my favorite artists, Jim Chung. Oh, man, they're going to have me buying a whole bunch of stuff. <laughs> you come in here. I like seeing a whole bunch of stuff. But then when they... Oh, that's cool, too. The foreshortening. That's cool. Wow. I 
like that one. See if I like it right away. That's cool. I'm gonna have to come back and see. Maybe I'll get a more, more. That's cool. I like that symbol and the way they got it on there. Now that's cool. Wow. Got me buying all of these. That's cool too. That's Capolo. You know what? Wait a minute. I'm gonna have to look and see if I get this in. Yep, Jenny Crisson. Wait a minute. I can't buy all of these. These are cool looking covers though. Wow. Oh, Jason Fabok. Very cool. Okay, I'm going to set them aside. I may go back and get some of the special covers, like cover grabs, like I said, because I, I didn't read the story. But I like to see what's going on with them. That's cool. Gates of Gotham. Okay, let's see what else we got. Batman Beyond. Like I said, I came here to try to find... Um, that's cool. I love um, Ed McGinnis. There's Dave Finch. Wow. Batman Dark Knights. Those are cool. The artwork's just beautiful in those. City of Light. Batman Beyond. I've been coming across a lot of um, these Fort Zero Points from Fortnite stuff. I look at, I mean, I like this cover too. I mean, you look at the, look at all the lines and everything he had to do, and somebody had to ink that. Wow. These, I think, are going for a little bit of money, but like I said, I don't, I, I got some already. And Captain America, I love all the, his covers from Alex Ross. Some of these I didn't have, and I couldn't find, I couldn't remember. It might have been this one I didn't have, but I don't have my list with me. That's cool. That's cool. I looked at this. This painting is going for, I think, either ten or twenty something thousand dollars on Alex's site, and he has the uh, pencil version that's smaller, probably about this size or smaller, drawn really good, um, almost like detail where, where it could be inked or something. Where um, that's going for like a thousand. So if you were to spend twenty one thousand, or or if it was ten thousand for the cover. Eleven thousand dollars, I think it was that. You can get the pencil drawing and the actual painting. I bet you the actual painting is absolutely gorgeous in color. They say when you see the original artwork of his, it's beautiful. Wow. You know, one of my friends, Andrew, in Australia, he said he bought a. He's got an original Alex Ross, so he could probably attest to that. But I'd love to see the original artwork. These are beautiful. I might pick these up just because they're Alex Ross. Wow. Always like that one. I'll probably come back to those. These Captain America or Captain Marvel covers are good too. I'll to make sure I get get everything in camera. Captain Marvels. That's cool. Let's see what else. And John Romita did some artwork. And John Cassidy. And Trevor Harrison must be doing the artwork on the inside. It's cool when you start to look at these and you can recognize um, by the artwork who, who who did what. That's when you collect them a whole bunch. And see, I don't know what these are worth. I think I got number one of this series because Mc, Mc, McNiven's artwork is absolutely beautiful. Here's five, here's four, here's three, and here's two. And I think I'm going to get those. I'm not sure about this one, Brew Baker. I know it's probably written well. But I think I'm going to get these over the Captain America one. And I think I have this one, but did Andy... I think I have this one, but I'll grab this again, I think. Because Andy Granoff and his artwork is beautiful. Let's see what else we got in here. That's cool. Hopefully, um, Kang will be good in the movie. That's cool. And see, I noticed this, there's, look at this, all the Cerebus artwork, or, or not artwork, but comic books. I found like three or four of them signed by um, the inker or the writer, a letter or something like that. I have to go back and check and see who it was, but they're all going for a dollar each. But these are the bi -week I guess these are the reprints, the bi-weekly ones, that's cool. Reprinting number one, cool. You see all of these, they're going... 
I had a chance to get some more work from it. But, okay, I gotta stop here. But I'll come back and I'll do another video. Thank you very much for watching. Let me know what you think. Click the dude out.